Hello everyone, welcome back to the Doing It Ace channel. Today we are going to learn about cookies in year 2. We will learn how to set a cookie and how to check if it exists and if that is so we are going to get the value of that cookie and print it out. So to do, to do this I am going to use my site control. You can use any controller or you can use a component or a behavior. Whatever way you want to do it, it's alright, it's pretty simple um, and it is the same for all. So I'm going to create my public function, public function action set cookie is going to be the name of the action and I'm going to create a cookie. So I'm going to use a class that is being provided by the framework e web cookie and I'm going to pass in my values. It has two properties, name. I'm going to name my cookie as test and a value of that cookie. So the value is going to be test cookie value. Okay, now we have to add it to the cookies. So I'm going to use the app get response. So remember it is get response because we are sending this cookie to the browser and I'm going to say get response get cookies and add this one so the key that will add our cookie now I'm going to create another function uh, which is going to check if this cookie is available this cookie and if that is so we are going to show it out so function action I'm going to say show cookie and Put in a if statement, let me scroll up, if statement, this time I'm going to say e app get request, so remember when the request comes I'm going to check, so that's why it is get request, when we are setting the cookie it's get response, so get request and uh, check if get cookies and this one has this cookie not the cookie object the name of the cookie so the test if that is so I'm going to print our the value of the cookie so we app get request get cookies and get value and the pass in the name of the cookie okay i'm gonna save now i'm going to add these actions to my behavior so it will work so the first one is set cookie and the next one is show cookie okay i'm first going to go into the show cookie and prove that there is no cookie set show sorry site cookie oh we have a cookie that is not the value we have set so the value should be test cookie value but since I have created let's change the name since I have I did test case and uh, I have actually created a test cookie so before this lesson so what I'll do is I'll create a new cookie which is test one and here it's going to be test one and here it's going to be test one so now it's going to check for a test one cookie I earlier set a name the same name as test so that's why it came it popped up anyways now there is no cookie called test one I'm going to set the cookie go by going to this action so that will set the cookie now I'm going to go back again to the show cookie and we have the test cookie value so that is how you create a cookie and add it to the add it to your cookies and you are you can easily get the value of this cookie by using the get request get cookies get value test or the name of the cookie uh, we will be using this in the later on lesson for internet internationalization so so yeah so that covers this one i hope you guys enjoyed this one uh, stay tuned for more and do subscribe share my tutorials have fun take care bye